Hey, what's going on guys? Logdad Zip here. Welcome back to You Guessed It Baby, Only One Command. Minecraft Redstone series where showcase to amazing command block rages that only take one command to add to your Minecraft world. And in this case, we have fantastic furniture. Look at it all. Tables, chairs, sinks, stoves. I can actually cook. I mean, really, where's the pork? Ah, we can cook things on this. You gotta be kidding me. And it's only with one command. Well, <laughs> It's with two commands, but who asked you guys anyway? They're all by the Red Engineer. If you want to find out more information about his channel, including a link to all of the commands shown here, which is going to include kitchen furniture, living room furniture, and bedroom furniture. Uh, never mind the fans. So stick around, because we got a lot of houses to decorate in this episode. And if you want to see more only one command on the channel, then I do encourage you to leave a like rating on this video right now. And thank you so much. If we can get 2,500 likes, then I'll get another OOC for you. ASAP. And of course, subscribe so you can see it right as it comes out. So with that, let's get to decorating. Yo, check this place out. Diamonds galore. Anyways, it's time to decorate the first house. It's called You Tried by Dragon. Oh, come on, man. Give yourself a little more effort than that, Xavier. Yo, coming in with the houses. In fact, the whole map. Seriously, he's the man. You gotta check out Xavier. His channel's also in the description. Anyways, these are these houses. What we have here is every single chest containing all the different kitchen furniture that we've already seen. And it's time to get decorated. We've got all the eggs here. And again, all the different recipes that we've already covered. I'm just gonna be grabbing all the different spawn eggs. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna be decorating room by room by room. And there's like five different houses for us to do this with. So, we're in luck, baby. It's gonna be Good. <sighs> well, he wasn't kidding. Well, at least you tried, Xavier. So, here we are in this little house. We have all of the tools we need to bring all this furniture to life in place. And so, I'm just going to very briefly decorate these rooms. Just so you can get an idea of what we're working with. And then, we've got four more houses right around the corner. Let me look at the palm trees. It's going to be fantastic. That we're going to be decorating specifically with certain types of rooms in mind. So, why don't we go ahead and play some of these. And you can see how this might look. Alrighty, found me a good room for the kitchen. So what we have here are as follows. Table, stove, sink, chair, and drawer. Not bad. Why don't we start placing these things down? So we've got a table. Why don't we put the sitting table right here? Ooh, that looks nice. All lit up and everything. Some chairs to go along with it. And let's see. We'll, we'll go ahead and put the stove here. We'll put, ooh, kind, kind of matches a little bit. Yeah, it matches a little bit. And we could put... Mm, a couple drawers. Now look at that. Didn't that look nice? Convenient. So there's our kitchen stuff. Convenient. And not only that, but all the kitchen stuff comes with unique features as well. I mean, really, look at this beautiful, stupid, love this stupid seat. So you can actually sit on all these tiny little stools. You can actually place things, believe it or not, right on top of. In fact, well, I'm gonna give it a buy item. Okay, so watch this guy, huh? Placed. Okay, well, uh, <laughs> right. Well, it looks a little bit better with food on the table instead. But there's actually two different places that you can place items on this table. One on this side and one on the opposite side. Look at that cake. Delicious. I want some. Up next here, we have ourselves something really good. It is all the living room furniture. The couch. The table. Living room furniture, a part one. Living room furniture, a part two. Of course, TV and a potted plant. Everyone's favorite to put the living room. It's got makes things smell nice. And most importantly, it's right by the kitchen. So I'm gonna place the TV down first. That's a nice first flavor. Mm. But we're gonna go ahead and, right, right, right. The ultimate flat screen. So you can actually combine them as you can see here. And I think the couch is probably gonna be a nice fit. Yeah, throw a pillow with it and everything. Can we combine the? here ooh, how does it look though you know what they've got their own little armrest we're gonna go with it naturally the table can go right behind ooh what an interesting little guy we got there oh maybe the table goes in mm, hey hey that's fun little table guy and we can combine them like okay well that doesn't look as good oops well that's what these levers are for anyway check these babies out huh we've got ourselves remove and remove furniture you can use these levers again you just rename them remove and remove furniture. Oh man, I just ruined everything. Well, the idea here is you can get your furniture back when you do this. Some of these require you to actually just break the block underneath. For example, some of these guys, you need to break the blocks underneath in order to get the furniture to disappear, but some of them require your lever. Now I gotta... <laughs> Come on, man! Actually, I think I showed you everything I needed to anyway, so we only had one thing left. 
Here's the potted plant. <laughs> Enjoy. And for our final trick, I mean, I mean room, we have ourselves the bedroom. So we have ourselves a TV, a ceiling fan, a wardrobe, another TV, a bedside table to go with our beds. Let's decorate. I mean, if the TVs only spawn this direction, the beds gotta spawn this direction, right? Yeah, check out this bed. Fancy. It's good stuff. And you can even go crazy with it. Do one block underneath. Pillow party, biggest pillow fight ever. Get it, I'm telling you. Of course, you got your bedside tables that can go on either edge there. They look real good. Now, of course, you probably want to light up this area with glowstone or lighting of some sort, just in case, just to get rid of all these like nasty looking. Like, come on, what's up with this? Whoa, it's literally changing color as well. We're gonna call it a feature, okay? <laughs> a ceiling fan that you actually have to place in your ceiling and get this thing wardrobe yeah i placed it on the wrong side oh man this is not gonna be oh boy now that we've ruined one house though it's time for the real deal check this baby out in this house is focus which the house is made by the way adventuring villa by ghost Tay one nice all builds in the description i'm cool like that yeah well thank you guys by the way for the <laughs> oops look i did my best to fix the sign okay we're focused today is the kitchen so we're gonna grab all the different kitchen supplies by the way if you're wondering the recipes this is how you make all the individual things i have no idea what i just said right there don't, don't worry about it but just so you know if you want to make a table, for example, you take two quartz slabs and four sticks, you throw them on the ground, bada boom, bada bing, and you get yourself the table. So, if you want to find out all the recipes, just pause the video. This is how you make each individual one. And these other items down here, well, these are for placing on top of and or cooking. Well, I'll show you a sec. So, in here we have a nice little kitchenette area carved out for us to start placing all of our different tools. So, why don't we begin by making a nice little center island area. We'll start with the stove and the sink. So, stove. Well, this is going to be our little cupboard area pantry, you know, keep all the goodies. Why don't we place you, I think about the table, yeah, okay, this is coming together in my head real good. Okay, so there is our stove. And before we go any further, this is exactly what I wanted to show you. Where's the pork chop? If you drop a pork chop on top of the stove, listen, you hear that? Listen to that. Oh, baby. It actually starts to cook. And after 10 seconds time, get this, it will actually turn into a cooked pork chop. Are y'all ready for that golden brown? Delicious. Are you gonna turn already or what? There we go. Coming together. So I think if we get close to it, we can actually just kind of... Jeez. Okay, jeez. That is yeah, not worth doing. Just get a stove. Forever, man. But yes, moving swiftly on, we're going to go and place a sink right next to our stove as well. And if you're wondering what happened here, I went ahead and added a couple extra blocks. Got to make everything stand out, look real nice. We'll place some drawers right here. Mm-hmm. We'll place one right here. Mm-hmm. And hey, we should throw mm-hmm. And you know what? That looks really nice. In fact, it kind of looks, uh, well, I would, you know, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and keep it this is gonna be nothing yeah we probably get rid of that too there now it looks much okay now it looks okay yeah you should just use everything together well best part about this is you can actually stand on all of it and you can not only that but you can fall into the sink as well look hanging out in the sink drinking from the water what'd you think don't like my rap well you stink <laughs> man i should just give up well i think our table can go over here and i think we should have a nice little long table how about Boom. Oh, two of them. Nah, 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 nah. I ain't playing that game. Wait, I think, you, yeah, you just break the block in order to get the table. Ah, okay. Table looks great there. Now it's time to add the chair. Man, I'm just on a roll with the rhymes right now. Seriously. So here's all of our different chair friends. And again, the best part is you can sit on all of these guys. And that just get out of my way, invisible horse. If you're wondering what's going on here. Yes, it's all invisible horses. Ooh, and a couple of them are dying. So you can't sit on all the chairs, I guess. And again, the best part about all the tables is you can decorate them all by right clicking on them with items of your choice to place them down look at this it's coming together 
so nicely and you can even do it on top of the drawers as well so check it out we need to just find the perfect place to yeah see takes a little bit of effort but if you can find it everything looks really nice i mean seriously this is a kitchen right here look at her look around we can do the whole shebang in here cook clean feed entertain i'm sold time for the next room House number three. Thanks, Playbuilds Creative. What do we have here? It looks like a focus on the living room. I think we're gonna be able to do this just fine. We've got ourselves the couch, the table, living room, living room, TV, potted plant. Okay, let's get to decorating. So here we are in this house's living room and currently I can say it needs a sprucing up or two. I mean, look at this door. What's going on with the door, man? It's crazy looking. So what we have here are all of our furniture supplies and we need to get to decorating. So I'm gonna break everything in here and we're gonna start from scratch. So we'll go ahead and place our TV right here. Now are you kidding me? So we're gonna go ahead and place our TVs right here, again, with the flat screens, that good stuff. And again, where do we want this couch to be? I'm thinking this is a good distance. Thank you, Mr. Polar Bear. Your sacrifice, much appreciated. And same with your friend. Where can I place you now? Gotta wait for the stupid outline to appear. You know what I'm talking about? Got him. Boom, look at it. Yeah, with the four armrest action. Duel. <laughs> the ultimate couch. Now, I wish I could turn this TV on. Place our side tables down right here. Thank you so much. They're side tables now. I don't care what you think. Just... Oh, it looks terrible. What am I doing? Heck, we should place a table underneath here, too. Yeah, coming in with it. Okay, one right here, and we'll place one right here. Look at that. We got a nice little table for our sitting area and everything. Don't worry about those. Throw a plotted plant. Plotted, I said. Plotted plant. We're going to throw a plotted plant right there and another plotted plant right there as well. And why not a few just plotted plants everywhere? You know, this is my green room. Who asked you anyways, huh? Overall, I'm pretty satisfied with how this room turned out. I mean, seriously, check this out. We got the big old TV. My head is going crazy. Slow things down a little bit, Tyler. <laughs> what the heck? Seriously. Okay, anyways, we're gonna go and look this way instead. TV looks awesome. Potted plants are great decoration. We got the nice little drawer area. Table. If I'm not mistaken, we can probably place things down on this guy as well. Really, I'm gonna find out right now. Flower pot, do me right, but yeah, you can add things to this guy too. It's the best total innovation. And of course, you have yourself this lovely couch with all the sitting capacity you could ever need. Look at that. You wanna sit in that seat? That's fine. You wanna sit in this seat? That's fine too. This third seat? Oh, you know. Wait, can I? Okay, oh, you know. Oh, geez. Someone help me. The final house. So much potential, so little time. Yes, I am afraid, my friends, that is gonna be where we end this episode. But I wanted to know if you wanna see me decorate the final house in a live stream. You've already seen all the furniture, so I don't want to go overkill with explaining how it all works. But if you wanna see a live stream where I decorate based on what you guys in the stream suggest to me, then you can let me know by dropping a like rating on this video right now and leaving a comment if that is something that interests you. All the same, though, that has been bedroom furniture, living room furniture, and kitchen furniture, all in all. Only one command, and by one command, I mean a few commands, but whatever, who asked you guys in there? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this one command. If you did, you want to see more of them on the channel, then please do drop a like rating on this video right now. It means so much to have your support. We get 2,500 likes, and I'll make sure to get another one. Only one command, ASAP. A big thank you once again to the Red Engineer for all of the commands showcased in today's video. If you want to find out more information about them, or check out some other one commands that you have not seen on my channel, then you can do so on his channel found in the description of this video as well. Hope you all enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe so you can see the next one right as it comes. Out, and with that, I leave you. Have a good day and get to decorate, my friends. We'll see you later.